Hey AI wizards, in this video we're exploring workarounds to a common issue that pops up when running AI apps on platforms like Colab, Kaggle, or SageMaker Studio Lab. Ever found yourself unable to download that coveted model because it's only available to signed in users? Yeah, we've all been there, especially with platforms like Civit AI or TensorArt. Attempting a download without signing often leads to a frustrating dead end page. But worry not because I've got a couple of tricks up my sleeve for you. So here's the first quick hack. It's a simple workaround that currently works on Civit AI and TensorArt, and it's compatible with Chrome and Firefox. In your browser, sign in and initiate the download. Pause it to save space, check the download history, right-click the model and copy its link address. Now paste this URL into your notebook's appropriate command to successfully download the model. For a test run, we'll use the Focus Kaggle notebook. This link has a short lifespan, but it's ample for grabbing the model. And let's not stop there, we can grab Alora the same way. Another option for adding models involves running a file browser web UI. This one's great if you have the model on your local disk and want to upload it. The file manager notebook we're copying from here is conveniently linked in the description. Copy and paste these code blocks into your existing notebook and the upgrade is complete. You can now install and start the file browser, perform various file operations, and crucially, upload models from your PC. If your download gets interrupted, whether in the file browser or during a notebook download step, no worries. Delete the corrupted model from the file browser and re-download. You can also check the file size in the browser to ensure it matches the full model size. An incomplete model won't cut it for image generation. Running out of persistent storage? No problem. Upload the model to temporary storage in the Kaggle temp folder using the file browser. Trick your apps into using the temp model by creating a shortcut with the lns command in your notebook. When you're done using the model, you can delete the shortcut from the file browser. This keeps your permanent storage clutter free. With your model in the right folder, stop the file browser and continue your generative AI adventures.
I hope this video streamlines your model and file management on Kaggle. Keep imagining, generating, and sharing your awesome artwork. See you in the next video, creators.